Redford Police and Redford Township facing a lawsuit tonight for the rough arrest of an older man with health problems. And video obtained by the local four defenders. An officer can be seen tripping the man to the floor of the township offices and using his taser twice on him. Well, that man later died. Local four defender Sean Lay is live. The family, Sean, says this arrest played a part in his death. We took a look at their lawsuit, Kimberly, today, and they are saying that the use of the taser, in their opinion, in this case was absolutely unnecessary, and they do believe it led to their loved one's death. Take a look at the video. You are looking at a Redford Township police officer taking down a 58-year-old man with a swift kick to his legs to knock him to the floor. In his report, Redford Officer Ramirez states that he first put his hands on 58-year-old Baja Jundi when Jundi was sitting down, stating his case about a ticket he got for long grass. And he says Jundi refused to leave. Ramirez grabs Jundi. Jundi pulls back. There's a struggle, and the officer uses his taser on Jundi. He hits his head on a counter. The officer then zaps him again. This took place in June of 2019. Jundi's family says he immediately had kidney failure after the tasing. Ten days later, Jundi had a stroke. By November, he was dead. His family is suing Redford Township and Redford Police. Majid Mogni is the family attorney. Number one, he should have never been arrested to begin with. No force should have been used on him. He was not he was not a threat to anyone. A township employee called police saying Jundi was irate over the ticket, but then told police that he calmed down. An employee and the officer asked him to leave the township offices, but he wanted his issue to be resolved. Mogni says there had to be a better way to handle this. To pull out your taser on an old man, to body slam him, to trip him, it's just uncalled for. Redford, Town, Redford Township Supervisor tells us that they do not comment on pending litigation. Attorney Majid Monia that you saw right there. In addition to the civil suit tonight, he's calling on the prosecutor to take a look at the officer's actions. We're live tonight. Sean Lane, local force defense. Certainly more to come on this story. All right, Sean, thank you.